Hey, how's it going everyone? Black Cat Hobby here with some more of that Pokemon Pearl Nuzlocke. Did a little bit of quick grinding just because Mater and I think Starly's gonna get called Sylph. I still haven't figured out how to rename it yet. And I don't entirely know if that's the name we're gonna keep. But uh, yeah, did a little bit of quick leveling. Bonaparte's at level 8. Same moveset. Mater's level 5. All he gained was Defense Curl. And Sylph, or Sylphie, I don't know, uh, also level 5, gained Quick Attack. Now, main reason, and I had mentioned I was going to talk about this, um, why it had been so long since I had posted, is the blower motor in my furnace that cycled the AC, but also the heat, gave out on me. And, uh, yeah, it's a bit of a problem when it gets too warm to be able to actually record. Uh, the other reason I wanted to do a little bit of grinding is I know some of the trainers in here can be a little rough. And there's also, given my starter, something I'm trying to avoid that I wanted to be able to catch, but no luck. Quick trainer battle. I have to be a Pokemon trainer too. Alright, so that's the battle we must. So we're going to get to Jubilife, and I may end it there. I haven't decided yet or if I'm going to go through all of Jubilife yet. So he's got a Starly. And we're just gonna water gun this Starly. It's a fast little jerk. But given that Piplup is a special attacker, it's would seem, at least so far. So yeah, I wanted to grab Starly. So, so I'm happy that we got one, uh, in case we run into grass types. But in this area, and I believe going forward, you can also run into a Shinx. And I really wanted to get a Shinx just because I happen to like Shinx. 380, woo, that's not even enough for two Pokeballs. These are kind of pointless. Trainer tips, yeah, talking about XP and battles. And here's another battle. Uh, last Natalie. What does she have again? Badoof. Down. What are they sending in? Level 9. Yeah, that'll help. I'm gonna keep the current. Lovely. That is not what I want to do encounter right now. I want to do encounter him in a way I can catch him. Ooh, yeah, um... Since he doesn't have Intimidate, he's probably got the one that can stun you. And this guy's got a change too. Dang it. <clears throat> okay, at least this one's got Intimidate. But at level 
five. Uh, this is a risk. Okay, I was definitely expecting a different move than that. Let him again. I'll hopefully finish him off. Good. Oh, he's a special attacker? Huh. Go figure. We'll see if that keeps up. They're like, wow. <laughs> Should be fine for the moment. Now, if I go in there, almost guaranteed to encounter a Shanks, and it's all for an antidote, I believe it was, so not worth it. Hi, uh Hobbies, -huh, are you catching Pokemon? Um, I think you'd feel a lot safer if you were to catch some more. The game's rules for a Nuzlocke. Don, I can't catch more. See what I said, either it's a trainer school, which, well, you know... Obvious, you should visit it. You'll get some tips on Pokemon. Oh yes, Loser went to the trainer's school earlier. Okay, bye now. Hmm. I'm gonna hold off on one thing in the trainer's school. That I know. Probably take care of some other things here. Okay, so the two that are on the carpet over here, um, both use Abra's, but because it's an Abra and you can't have it just only teleport, they actually gave him Charge Beam. Which, I will probably come back and get the TMs they give you, which I believe is Work Up or something like that, later. Because with my current party, Abra's knowing Charge Beam are gonna probably make me lose. So, later. Hey, hubbies. Did you come to study too? I went ahead and memorized everything that was up on that blackboard. After all, it's the trainer's job to avoid having the precious Pokemon hurt in battle, right? So, Hobbies, what brings you here? You've got something for me? So what is this? Score! It's a town map! Huh? Why are there two in here? I like it a lot, but I don't need two. Here, Hobbies, you take one. Good, town map. Hmm, well, according to the town map, I guess Orberg City is where I should be going next. There's a gym, so it'd be perfect for raising a Pokemon I just caught. Well, I'm on the road to becoming the greatest trainer of all time. See you around. Oh, you are a Pokemon trainer, but you don't have a Pokets yet. Pokets is short for Pokemon Watch. Oh my, you are a rare case indeed. You see, I invented and now manufacture Pokets. Not only that, I'm now conducting the Pokets promotional campaign. All you have to do is find three clowns in Jubilife City. If you can't find them... Whatever. I'll give you your very own Pokets. It's probably supposed to be if you can find them, but I'm fairly sure it's that can't, but whatever. Hi, I'm a Pokecatch campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Does a Pokemon grow by defeating others and gaining experience points? Should be obvious. 
Pokemon grow stronger by defeating other Pokemon in battle. Some Pokemon even change into a different Pokemon through a process known as evolution. They don't teach that in schools. I don't know, maybe they do. I don't... Uh, school was a while ago. Here you go, Pokex Coupon. Not to mention it's one of those things that, uh, yeah. Depending on what the government says, who knows what they're teaching in school right now. You put the coupon one in your bag's key items pocket. Good for me. Number two. Well, Pokex Campaign Clown, let's roll out my quest in. Can a Pokemon hold an item? Yes. hold a single item. Some items become effective as soon as they are held by a Pokemon. Berries are eaten by a Pokemon as necessary during battle, yada yada. Second coupon. Clown the third. Pokeheads campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Yes. Moves of Pokemon also have types. And he's just explaining about same uh, type uh, attribute bonus, I believe is what the acronym is. So, STAB. Let me count your coupons. I'll just pull out my code cuts here and one, two, three, bravo. I say bravo. In return for these coupons, I present you with this Pokemon Watch, or Poketch for short. You received a Poketch. Okay. So, basically, this was more useful in the original version. So if we hit R, it'll pop that up, gives us a clock. Hit R again, pulls it up bigger so you can manipulate it. A calculator. Woo. A step counter. Woo. What I kept it on the most when I was playing this on a portable. Because that actually can be useful. And back to a clock for now. Back to smaller and hold to turn off. Because with this setup it just kind of gets in the way. So this video is probably going to be done here shortly. Because uh, in all honesty, I actually probably need to go do some training because we're going to have a rival match here in a moment. But, I want to do this. An old rod is a good thing, you think so too? Am I right? Sure. Good answer, we can be friends. Here you go, here, that's my old rod. So we pop in here to 218. I hit the wrong button. Sorry, everybody. Alright, we're going to go ahead and favorite that for now. Okay, I guess I do still have to go the long way. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Huh. Okay. That's useful. There we go. Yeah. 
Yeah. I don't want to just destroy it. Okay, there we go. Hey, Starla got a level. Nice. Hopefully, the nickname I'm giving it is Gender Neutral. This is mostly because of what its mega form looks like. At least according to some. Once it evolves, obviously. Right, so we're up to four Pokemon. But, uh, yeah, I gotta go do some more leveling, whether I want to or not. And that's mainly because, if I'm understanding things correctly, my rival, Loser, is gonna have a Turtwig. Which is fine, except I have nothing that currently is effective against a Turtwig, and his would be effective against Shrimp and Bonaparte. So I need to try to get a flying move on Silphy, or Silph, or whatever it's going to get called. So, yeah, I think I'm going to call it here, I'm going to go do some grinding just to get a few more levels, try to get something I can use against the Turtwig. It won't be ideal, but it's better than nothing. Uh, otherwise, hey, I've been Black Cat Hobbies, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, I know it was a shorter episode, but the next one should have another catch. A, tra a rival battle, some other trainer battles. Actually, might be two catches because I think we're going to go through the Orberg gate to get to Orberg City as well. So yeah, hit that notification icon to be notified when the next one comes out. And I'll be seeing you all then. Have